Jeremy Green's expectations. <laughs> the Seattle Seahawks had three picks in the damn draft. Hey, they're all on the screen. <laughs> yeah, hot. Yeah. All right, let's let's Incomplete. let's roll. Let's roll through them here. Incomplete. Uh, the <laughs> your riskiest pick. <clears throat> excuse me. Your riskiest pick was the guy you took in the second round, Dwayne Eskridge, the wide receiver out of Western Michigan. Love the talent. He's damn fast. I do not know how Russell Wilson's going to get in the ball. I think now you have th and and the thought. And the way it's been explained to me is we now have three guys that are so dynamic over the top that you can't put too many guys in the box. Yep. You can't send too many at Russ. That's the only way we could fix the offensive line. Well, here's the thing. The offensive line still sucks. Yeah. I mean, it still sucks. Uh, and your defense still sucks. Uh. <laughs> You're the worst team in this division. No you doubt. You may not want to hear that. You may not. Uh, I mean, I'm sure there will be Seahawks fans in the comments. And, oh, you don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, I kind of do. Yeah, I kind of do. And Russ does, too. And there's a reason he's been so vocal. Yep. Because he's getting real friggin' tired of running for his life. Mm -hmm. And he's getting real tired of watching his defense give up points. Well, it sucks being the best quarterback in this division. And, and, being, and, on the worst and team. being on the worst team. You have the best quarterback in the division. Mm -hmm. hey, hey, and think about this. Before you tell me I'm wrong, I want you to think about something Seattle Seahawks fans. If, Ru if Russell Wilson decided, I don't want to play football anymore. Yep. I'm just going to go the fuck home. Yep. How many games do you win? Three. At best. It's three at best. Mm -hmm. You would instantaneously be one of the worst teams in the NFL. And it's the truth. And you know it's the truth. You may not want to hear it, but it's the truth. And you know what? You look at a team like, uh, let's just go another team in this division. L.A. Rams. Let's say you're stuck with John Walford. Matt Stafford decides to... Go whack surfboards for a living or whatever the fuck he wants to do. <laughs> mm -hmm. You're still going to win six or seven games. Yep. Because you got Aaron Donald. You got Jalen Ramsey. You got a dog defense. I I'm just telling you. I'm just telling you. And I love the Stone Forsyth pick, by the way. A lot of people killed him for trading up for that. Mm -hmm. uh, I think he could be a starter on this line pretty fast. Okay. I don't think it's going to take that long. And then Trey Brown, he is your best value pick. was the third thing on the screen. Yeah. Right? <laughs> I mean, he, he fit. Was, right, yeah. right. Okay. All right. That's 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 fine. All right. But here's so the thing. Three picks, he had to have it. three qualifiers. I guess yeah. that's where he falls I, in. I saw somebody in the comments say, Russ is going to cook behind this line. Uh, I want you to understand what's what, what this line is. Uh, Dwayne Brown, uh, never had a problem with him. I, I like Dwayne Brown. We're good. Damian Lewis, Ethan Pochich, do like Gabe Jackson. And Brandon Shell is your right tackle. Let me tell you something about Brandon Shell. And I'm sure you already figured this out because you got to watch him play last year. This is a guy the New York Jets looked at and went, you're unsalvageable. No shot. Remember George Fant, that sixth tackle you had years ago? Mm -hmm. The Jets looked at him and went, that's markedly better. So you better hope to God Stone Forsyth can be that right tackle because Brandon Shell is not a legitimate tackle in this league. Uh, Adam Black said in the comments, where do all the bandwagon Seahawks fans go? They left Arizona. last year. They came They they came to Tampa. Yeah, they, they go to <laughs> Arizona. <laughs> the comment was, Russ will be cooking from home behind this line. <laughs> oh, aha. Uh -huh. I, I, I read it. I read it incorrectly. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, which is 100% true because he's just going to be like, ah. Uh, but uh, L.E.M., uh, uh, good, good for you. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, I, I didn't read that right. My bad. That's a good stuff, though. That's that's funny as 